there, Codiers. Kip here from How to Cody. I'm going to show you another add-on to help you watch some more TV shows and movies. Now, just to give you a quick little idea, this is what I'm going to show you is how to install something called Specto. Now, to give you a little background on Specto, Specto used to be known, uh, was uh, actually known as Genesis. Uh, somebody else picked it up after the programmer Lambda uh, abandoned uh, Genesis to move on to his new project, Exodus. So the person, whoever picked up uh, Specto, thank you very, very much. Uh, you've filled, you've maintained a void that uh, uh, a lot of people started panicking on the internet for. So I'm going to show you how to set up Specto. Specto is very much the same as Exodus, or for you former Genesis users, uh, it's the same thing as Genesis. Uh, they've got with a couple little uh, added tweaks in there, uh, including Tracked, uh, so you can save your favorites offline. Great idea. So. Here's how to add, here's how to install it. What I want you to do is go over to your system. Click on your file manager. Let that open up. I want you to add a source. There we go. Now, please make sure that you have typed this exactly as I do HTTP colon backslash backslash film Cody dot com slash slash repository please just like any these are this with these paths make sure they are 100% correct once you have it, mate, you're your 100. You're sure everything's good. Click on done. Now it comes up here saying that it wants to call it a repository. Uh, that doesn't fall in line with everything else. Just like Fusion, you had to call Fusion Fusion. So please, uh, it's okay to be a sheep in this case. So film Cody. Now, any of you eagle-eyed view, view, viewers can see I've already got it installed. So, there you go. Make sure that this is 100% correct. Filmcody.com slash repository and call it Filmcody. All right, I'm clicking cancel. Like I said, I've already got it installed. Now, next thing you want to do is that you want to go home. You want to click on your system. Go over here to your add-ons. And you're going to install from a zip file. Double click that. There we go. Film Cody. Now what we want to get is the repository filmcody.com. That third one there. If you have more on your list, don't worry about it. It's okay. So once that's installed, now you want to install from, oh, pardon me, you want to install from the repository. There we go. Filmcody.com repository, Mr. No. You want to install this. Go to your video add-ons. There we go, my friends. Specto Fork. So we're going to install that. Let it download. Wait for the confirmation down here in the bottom. Add-on enabled. Fan Fantastic. So we're, go we're going to jump back to home here. We'll go over to videos. We're here in the add ons. And there it is, my friends. Specto. You can add you now. I, I, I recommend two, one thing all the time. Before you even use any new add ons, make sure that it is 100% up to date. You can do two methods one, exit out. Reload Cody, and it should be good. The other one you can do, right click on it, or if you're a tablet user, hold your finger on it. Bring up the add-on information. Right here, now as you can see, the version is 2016-04-11-01. Let's click on update. Well, it appears that's the most up-to-date one. Click on it anyway, just to be safe. Add-on has been updated. We're ready to go. 
So once you pop in here, uh, I've already played with my view. So here we go. There is the simple views. Uh, bring it. You can bring up your movies. Change my views. Let's take a look at what's the most popular in here. Like I said, this is laid out just the same as Specto, or sorry, as Exodus and Genesis while it was gone. Uh, anybody curious about Genesis? Guess what? Don't worry about it. Ignore it. It's gone. Now, one of the things I have noticed about Specto, uh, I don't see as much high definition. Uh, but I don't. Re but that doesn't dismiss it. Uh, quite frankly, is you never know. They might. They may have some different. They have different feeds than you're gonna find uh, over there in Exodus. So it's worth a try. Both are fantastic. Both are, are really easy to use, and you might find some uh, uh, extra stuff that to, in one that you may not f or it didn't find in the other. Uh, also, uh, one other feature that it has. If we're gonna go click here on the tools. It has a tracked setup. Tracked is for the offline saving of your favorites. So take a look for my tracked video and how to uh, set up tracked for your uh, uh, for your specto. So there we go, folks. Works great. Uh, it, it, you know, it's it's always nice to to have multiple sources of what for your shows for your t and everything. Uh, I'm gonna pop this thing onto my favorites bar here because I do enjoy it. Uh, I now, and I hope you all have a great day. Uh, please make sure that you uh, click subscribe. Please like, click on like uh, down below there. Please make sure that you uh, uh, leave a comment or any suggestions that uh, you might find might be useful uh, for future videos. So thank you very much. Have yourself a great day and happy coding.